A city's water system is made up of networks of man-made and natural infrastructure. These include everything from water treatment plants to lakes to the users who benefit from water supply. In WaterShare, each of these elements are called components. Each coloured box on the screen is a different component and the lines connecting them show how these elements interact with each other within a city's water system. A number of common components are pre-programmed into the tool but each city is different, and the user can create new components that are specific to their city. The user can place components on the map and connect these to other elements in the urban water system. This illustrates how the different infrastructures relate within the system and which elements are dependent on others. What are the individual infrastructural assets that make up each component? Who are the stakeholders involved in the component? And what roles do they play in managing, financing, regulating, supplying, and using the asset? This last piece is critical because it speaks most directly to the role of governance in determining the health of a system. Are there roles that need to be filled? Are there too many organisations involved in one particular role? We can also see which shocks and stresses are likely to impact each element in the system with a low, medium or high probability. To better understand how a system functions in the wake of particular shocks and stresses, we can filter the screen to show only those components impacted by a particular shock or stress. For instance, what happens when we view only the elements of the system affected by coastal flooding? What about those elements impacted by riverine flooding as well? What if we wanted to know how the port of Rotterdam was involved in the city water system? And how it might be affected by future shocks? WaterShare also helps users better understand relationships between actors. These boxes represent all the stakeholders involved in the water system. The thicker lines suggest relationships where organisations are involved in the same component or directly connected in the system. We can select for one of those organisations to see how it relates to the rest. The power of this lies in the potential to reveal latent relationships to show where there is overlap in the remit of different organisations or where organisations may not actually speak with each other. We can filter users by sector, selecting all public sector stakeholders working within the city system. Or can view what shocks or stresses are likely to impact different stakeholders based on what components within the system they are involved with. By making information accessible and easy to understand, WaterShare will help improve collaboration across diverse actors.